Hey everybody, here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're comparing these two Billiner waters. First up is Billiner Naturally Sparkling Mineral Water. Next up is Billiner Alkaline Spring Water. These are both alkaline waters. They both have a pH level of about 7.5. And they're both from the Chez Republic. They're both from, obviously, the same company. And they're very old waters. The company was established in 16... 64 and before i go more into the waters let me explain where i got these from uh one of you viewers left a comment recommending a website called salaciousdrinks.com and this is a really perfect website for me at least uh this this website sells like foreign and unique bottles of water and the great thing for me is they sell individual bottles and um it's great for me to review them because normally if you buy like foreign waters on Amazon, you have to buy them by the case. And sometimes sometimes that can be 50, especially with the shipping costs. These were each just $1.99. And then you see all that packing packaging behind me? It was $12 shipping for 13 waters, because I'm gonna review more of this website's waters in the future. And I kind of have a compliment and a complaint at the same time. Um they used a ton of packing material for this water which is good because it keeps the water safe, but it's also like a little bit wasteful. It, look at this, all of this packaging material to ship 13 bottles of water. They actually packaged each bottle of water in this much bubble wrap, which is good if you don't want it to be broken. Like everything arrived perfectly, but if you're worried about the environment or anything, it's kind of ridiculous that they use that much material. Um, and it actually reminded me of this video that I shot about 10 years ago. And that was basically the whole joke of this video I made 10 years ago. The whole joke is just me receiving two big boxes and all that's in the box is one bottle of water. Isn't that weird? That's from like 10 years ago, and that's basically exactly what arrived to me. And um, that's sort of like the original John Drinks Water episode, because it's from like 10 years ago, before I started the whole YouTube channel, and I drink water in that video, so it's like the original episode. And so, it's a little bit wasteful, but it's also awesome of them to do that, because everything arrived perfectly. Like, a lot of the bottles I ordered were glass, and they arrived in perfect condition, so... You know, it works. So again, their website is salaciousdrinks.com. They gave me this business card. Um, I'm not being paid anything to advertise them. I don't think they even know I review water on YouTube. And um, I didn't even I didn't even get a discount or anything. But it's a it's a website I do recommend if you want to try out foreign waters. Because it's like it's just twelve dollars for for a big box for shipping. And um, these were only $1.99 each. I looked up the reviews for the sparkling water on Amazon, and they're actually pretty bad. A lot of people complained that it tasted like baking soda, and it tasted like salt. And one person on Amazon complained that there were large black particles floating around the water. And after I read his review, I looked really closely into the bottle, and he's right. I have that too. I have large black particles floating around the sparkling one. And it's not like one or two particles. There's a lot of like dirt in there, especially if I turn it upside down. There's just dirt floating around in the water. And this company actually replied to his Amazon review and said that's not normal. So it's happening to him and me. I checked the uh, the still waters and there's no dirt in these. It's only the uh, the sparkling one where that's a problem. So these both have 177 milligrams of sodium and they're both just natural. They're just 
from the source. Um, this is actually naturally occurring carbonation too. They don't just add CO2 to it. It's naturally occurring. But it seems bad to me that there's just all that dirt floating around in there. Let's open them up and do a comparison. Not a lot of carbonation, apparently. I don't see anything bubbling up at all, actually. Yeah. I didn't see any bubbles when I opened it. All right. Uh, here we go. Yeah, that's weird. It doesn't... It tastes really flat. Very flat. Uh, I'm going to pour this in here. Maybe it'll bubble up. Just to see if you guys can see some of the particles, maybe. But yeah, do you, you see that even when I poured it, there was, like, no bubbling. This is supposed to be a sparkling water. Ugh. I don't like it. It's like the flattest sparkling water I've ever had. Uh, here's the, the one that's supposed to be still. Wouldn't it be funny if this one bubbled up? <laughs> but no, this one's is still. This one just tastes a lot cleaner. Especially compared to this. An interesting thing is, <clears throat> I ordered one liter of the sparkling, and I ordered one liter of the still, and they actually sent me two half liters. <laughs> I guess that's because that equals one liter. But it was the same price. It was, a, it was $2 for this, and $2 for this, and it's an equal amount of water. This one tastes a little bit dirty, like a spring water, but it tastes a lot cleaner than this, than this, this sparkling stuff. Ugh. Yeah, I, I actually noticed that Amazon re removed this from Amazon, or, or maybe they removed it from Amazon, but... This, this was being sold on Amazon, and now it's not. Maybe they got too many complaints, because this does not taste good to me. This tastes not clean. Yeah, so the winner is th this one. It says it's royal class. And on the bottle, they list a bunch, bunch of uh, awards that they got. Yeah, my friend from college, Jake, is from the Chess Republic. He's a cool guy, but sorry, Chess Republic. I do not like your sparkling water. I wonder, like, how many times this has been shipped. Maybe that's why it lost the carbonation. It's been shipped from the Czech Republic to the United States. Maybe it's been shipped around the United States a couple times. Salacious drinks shipped it to me. So maybe it's just been, you know, shaking around so much that it just lost the carbonation. Okay, but this one is the winner, and this is moving on to round two. I don't want to finish this. 